Yo, what is up guys? And today we're going to be talking about the Samurai Jack ending that screwed a lot of fans over. The last episode is completely not what most of us or anyone expected. So basically every fan of the show expected there to be some big brawl between Jack and Aku, but that is not the case at all. What happened was that most, almost everyone from the original series who Jack had helped in one way or another came to help Jack, since he was being restrained in the final episode by the shape-shifting demon that was Aku. Take in note that was a coup. Now the reason why a lot of fans were mad about this is that we waited more than 10 years for the final season. So we assumed that now since the show is being aired in Adult Swim, we would see the final fight as a bloody showdown after all Jack had been put through. And other than that, the last so called fight between them was literally not even 2 minutes to be honest. The only positive thing about the episode was the fans were able to see the original opening theme song of the show since Aku played it while displaying a bruised samurai to the rest of the world. So anyways, majority of the episode is about everyone else trying to fight Aku, which they managed to do to a certain extent. Another plus in this app was the reunification of the Scotsman and Jack for what would become to known as their last time seeing each other. And it was kind of funny when the Scotsman kept trying to persuade Jack to marry one of his several daughters. Anyway, fast forward, Jack using Ashi's power gets sent back in time and strikes Aku. Now this was the problem for many fans. This if you think about it literally messed up the entire timeline of everything that ever happened. In a nutshell that means only Jack would remember everything from season 1 to season 4 and at the same time all those events never actually happened. This was bound to happen though but many fans anticipated that he would kill the present Aku in the future to undo the past and stay with Ashi in the future. Ultimately. When you think about the script, writers messed up the story. Personally, I don't think they thought about it that far. They just wanted the main character to get home after 10 episodes and finish the story. Tell me what you guys thought of the final season below in the comments. I will make sure I reply to as many of them as possible. Anyways guys, if you like that video, please make sure you leave a like down below, comment, share and subscribe. And I shall see you next week. As always, stay awesome.